Is TK on the phone? Yes. Oh, hello, TK. Yeah. Can you hear me all right? Yes. Oh, how are you guys doing this morning? Feel great, TK. How are you doing? Terrific. You know, hanging in there. It's late for me, but uh, I'm hanging in there. <laughs> TK is, uh, for people who are just joining us here, I've explained to Roy a little earlier, TK is the um, master wizard behind the website. He's the one who designed it. He's the one who um, made the reels spin. Uh, he uh, joined me uh, at the very, very beginning of this experience. And um, whatever uh, pleasure that you receive from this extraordinary experience, um, say thank you to this man. And TK, meet Roy. Roy, meet TK. Hi, TK. It's um, a pleasure. It's an honor, actually, and a pleasure. Th that website is amazingly imaginative and colorful and also simple. Uh, simple oh. to operate. Uh, wow, thanks so much. You're it's brilliant. It's an honor to be on your show, too, by the way, Roy. Good to meet you. Oh, thank you. But it's brilliant. We're, jukebox, is, it's brilliant. It's, it's, it's colorful, and it's easy to navigate. And um, I really, uh, my hat off to you. Oh, glad you like it. You know, it's the, the, the whole jukebox thing, it's it is kind of a natural, you know, it's... Uh, any media player that you know you have on your computer, it, it kind of resembles a jukebox in a way. And like Elliot mentioned, that the iPod is basically a jukebox in your pocket. So it was kind of a natural to to you know use the jukebox as just kind of a model and and let it just be that. That's, that's kind of what's a little bit different about this site. Is it's, there's no frills. It's kind of just that, and that's it's enough. It's you know I'm glad you like it. Well, it um, it is frills. It's beautiful. <laughs> well, thanks. Yeah. So, uh, you, do, are you in the website designing business? Uh, yeah, it's well, yes and no. It's just one of the things I do. I I kind of call myself a digital artist. You know, I uh, you know I, I work in music. I do sound design and even video editing. I did a lot of that stuff for Elliot's site and. Uh, graphic arts, uh, and, you know, coding and programming, it's kind of a place where, like, uh, as, as is evident on Elliot's site, it's, uh, it's where kind of technology and design meets with art and aesthetic things. You know, I'll, they always say that about architecture. It's, you know, a lot of engineering, but also art. And that's kind of what I've been doing too, is just stuff that straddles technology and art and, in engineering, really, and it's, you know, it's fun, and but it's a diverse thing. You know, it's not just web design, but web design is part of it. Explain to Roy, TK, and maybe some of our friends who are listening who are not computer savvy, um, what that essential challenge was for you when we first met, and I had all of this material that we had in the Flash format, and you looked at me and said, well, this is cool, but you can't play it on, com you know, wireless devices. Just walk us through that process. I think it's important to people. Well, when we started the project, uh, this is, you know, five years ago and change. And back then it was, you know, the smartphone didn't really rule the world yet like it does today. And and most people watched, uh, you know, they had access to the Flash plugin in their browsers because they were looking at the Internet on their computers and laptops and not so much their smartphones yet. And then... A couple of years later, uh, Flash becomes a, an anachronism. Um, Adobe says it's they're done with it; they're not going to develop it. It's going to go away. It's going to be replaced by other standards. And uh, so that caught, that kind of caught us by surprise. We did everything in Flash, and so we were faced with lots of devices out there, particularly iPhones and iPads, that they don't play Flash. And so we were faced with being locked out of a lot of stuff. So. I had to uh, basically rewrite everything and using just JavaScript and HTML5, and if you guys even know what that is. <laughs> no. But, uh, yeah, just to rewrite the whole thing over again. So, But uh, today, it, it they both coexist side by side. If, if you have a browser that has Flash in it, it'll play the Flash one, and if it doesn't, it'll play the other one. 
but it uh, it was definitely a challenge to try to um, replicate all the cool stuff you can do in Flash without it. Mm. Okay, <laughs> thank you, T does TK. <laughs> um, T- oh, oh, I, if somebody I, wants to get a hold of you, by the way, if they look if they look at ElliotMints dot com with two L's and one T, and they see how a brilliant job that you've done uh, aesthetically as well as practicality wise uh where do they uh, are you do you do website design for people yeah i mean i'm i'm kind of open to like uh, another passion project let's say you know if you're just like a you know a plumber or something you need a website there's plenty of you know website designers out there that can give you a nice site but you know if you want something special and cool and different and um something you know and it's something i can be passionate about and like doing i uh, definitely would be open to it so yeah the, my my website you can reach me through my website which is listed in on elliot's site um in a couple of places in the contact section but if you know if you want to know the site just from right now it's it's tkrocks.com um spell that tim i'll spell that yeah it's t-e-k-a-y-r-o-c-k-s.com there's an email there and etc you know Someone wants to reach me. And TKRocks.com. And Roy, b- before TK disappears into the into the night, and by the way, did you happen to notice TK is, of course, in a different state? He called in. Did you notice that the way he sounds on the air sounds nothing like being on a telephone? It's a good clear, uh, it's a clear signal, yeah. Yeah. TK... Oh. TK has his own way of communicating with the outside world involving, he's he's on a microphone, not a telephone. Yeah. I'm in my home studio right now. So it makes him appear as if he's here. The one thing I wanted to say was, beyond all the electronic wizardry, of all the people that I've encountered in my life, um, I can't name more than two or three who have given of themselves so tirelessly, shared so much, were such dear friends, supporters, believers in a vision that I shared, than this man. And whatever uh, success, and by the way, success in terms of my website, it's free, I, I, I don't make any money off of it, So the success will be how it touches other people's lives. And to that degree, whatever accolade I might receive, that's got to be split at least in half and shared with this uh, marvelous man for whom I will forever be grateful. Thanks, TK. Oh, you're so welcome, Elliot. Thank you. I really appreciate your uh, sentiments. You know, it's... There's a reason why, um, you know, I was, it's a, it was a passion project and there was a reason why I devoted, uh, you know, so devoted to it and seeing it through and seeing it done right. And, and, you know, cause it's, it's a special site. It's a, it's just a lot of special stuff on there and has a lot of potential. And, uh, it was a pleasure to work on it. And I was, you know, I was only, ha- only too glad to be, you know, uh, exposed to you, Elliot. And, to everything you've experienced and you know it was a treat in that sense um education and uh it was it was cool i loved i loved the experience don't drift too far tk i won't <clears throat> thank you tk yeah it was nice meeting you roy nice meeting you congratulations beautiful work thanks elliotmints.com with two l's um have you thought of going into business and making uh, Elliot Mints, that be the candy company? Uh, somebody Elliot suggested Mints, yeah. After Dinner Mints, ADM. That would be the candy. ADM. Uh, but uh, I'm only thinking about going out of business. The last time you were on the show, uh, 30 years ago, <laughs> yes, <laughs> there were no computers, uh, personal computers. No. There, there might have been a couple, uh, you know, like s- four people, that have maybe a Radio Shack something or other, or... There was no internet. There were no iPhones. There was no, nothing like that. Nothing. But there was the music. We had music, and the Rolling Stones were among the visionary music writers, musicians. Yes. 
And here is, this is from the 1960s. This proves that the future was envisioned in rock and roll. And then we have a couple of calls waiting. Here is a look at the future from the 1960s.